Another lesson of Vietnam was the importance of low-level aerial reconnaissance. But flying low over the jungle meant risking enemy ground fire, and hundreds of pilots died trying to provide good photo intelligence. To avoid similar casualties in a future war, Lockheed, the makers of the U-2, have developed a low-level spy plane, not unlike a glorified model aircraft, which flies by remote control. This thing is very survivable and has had uh, numerous tests to uh, determine its survivability characteristics. Uh, we've had uh, absolutely no problem surviving in, in, uh, in real live battlefield type environment. First of all, it's a fairly small air vehicle. It's fairly maneuverable. And, uh, and when it's painted in the camouflage uh, uh, gray or, or blue paints, it's, it's very hard to see in the daytime. It's a very low radar cross section and provides hardly any heat source for an infrared system to look at.